I think I killed the backup. Oops. Do I need the backup alive? My boys were killed. Hooray. Don't worry about a thing. I'm getting you out of there. I don't think Salvatore liked that. I don't think Salvatore liked getting bumped off the road. What kind of driving was that? You're trying to kill me? Mr. Leone, <gasps> oh, I'm sorry. What can I tell you? What just happened? The cutscene skipped and I got run over. <laughs> Tony, the first drink's on me. <gasps> oh! Hey guys, welcome back to Liberty City Stories. Today, we're going to be doing some more missions as soon as we get a phone call. Here it is. Anthony, it's Salvatore. Have you seen Maria? I swear, I can only find that bitch when she needs money. Come over and see me soon, I got some work for you. Look at these guys, strutting along. Gangsters. Anyway, let's go and see Salvatore then. Contraband. Oh! Oh, it's Maria! Next week if I hear another word She's trying to get money from you? That's right, big dick. What are you gonna do? Hit me? Why I order? That's the only time you touch me these days. Why the fuck would I want to touch you? I don't like you's goods. You revolt me. Me? Revolt you? What? Yeah, revolt. Oh, please. You know what? My daddy was right when he said you were nothing but a fat Yeah, ball. yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, Tony. I want my money, old man. Get out of here, you tramp. Hey, Anthony, you're an angel of mercy. Women, what are you gonna do about them, huh? Luckily, I can trust someone in my life. You, Tony. You're very important to me. Did I ever tell you that? You can't even get it up, you old bastard. Not for you. <laughs> I don't like using public toilets, you slut. Very important. So listen, it's you and me now. We're in charge. We got those fools on the run. How would you know? You're more interested in hanging out with men. <laughs> and you're only happy when you got your drawers around your ankles and your back against the wall. Oh my god. Christ, I met rabbits who like to fuck less than you. So listen, fuck this is you, important. Salvatore. Oh. You're no dick Just have her killed. Piece of fuck me. Shit. Fuck you. In fact, everyone has. Anyway, I got a shipment of you-know-what coming in. This is going to put us, you and me, on the map big time. Everything should run smooth. I just need someone someone I trust to take care of things for me. All right, Tony? I'll talk to you later. And another thing. I never met a girl with hydraulic underwear. It amazes me. Christ, why did I marry her? I was looking for a tramp. I married a slut. I must have really pissed someone off in my past life. I'll tell you that much. Wow. Get a vehicle with four seats. And pick up some backup. Okay. I was gonna use that, but oh well, that hasn't got four seats. So we're gonna use this. So we're finally, uh, the Jane Hopper lady, or Hooper or whatever, has finally given us uh, authorization to do a drug deal at the docks. So we're gonna pick up some men and go down there now. I think I killed the backup. Oops. Do I need the backup alive? My boys were killed. Hooray. Well, it looks like I'm going to be going to this drug deal by myself. So yeah, guys, it doesn't matter if your boys die, but uh, it means it'll be a bit harder 
for you to do the drug deal on your own. But uh, oh well. What kind of alarm is this? Excuse me. Okay, I'm gonna pull out my gun because all the eyes are gonna be on me now that my guys are dead. So normally you'd have three guys behind you, but obviously I got them all killed in seconds. So here we go. Hello. Hey, yes, sir. You were supposed to be here hours ago. Quit whining, Miguel. You got the stuff. Oh, it's Miguel busy man, from uh, GTA 3. Next time I'll find another buyer. Yeah, I doubt you find anybody else who pays what we do. Um, I haven't got any backup. <laughs> <laughs> I like you, Tony. You got big balls, like a bull. You got our money? Sure. Huh. What? You grease ball. You fuck. get the FBI on me, damn! Oh shit! Oh, Run! Fuck you all! <laughs> Couldn't have said that better. Now I just gotta lose the uh, remaining star by just hanging around for a little while. There you go, take the vehicle to Salvatore's lockup. Well, that did pretty well considering that we had no backup during that. We need a phone call now because we have no more missions. Hey Tony, it's JD. I hear it all over, you're headed for big things. I just hope you don't go forgetting your old pal JD when you get to the top, right? Oh, hey, I'm sure that time, won't okay, happen. Buddy? So, okay, so we got missions for JD right now, so let's go over and see him. Salvatore Salvation. JD. Hello, Tony. Thank God you're here. Oh, I'm sweating like my uncle in a schoolyard. Okay. Oh, my mind's going crazy. What are we gonna do? About what? Oh God, I can't believe it. He's gonna cut my balls off. He's gonna put them in a vice. 
Not necessarily that order. Oh, God. I feel like uh, the day the FBI searched my hard drive. You and your oh, uncle are like the same person, aren't you? Uh, you got any Valium or uh, Rohypnol? What about... Oh, no, no. See, I got too many of those. What's going on? Oh, God, I can't believe this. Why am I to blame? It's not my fault. But you know Salvatore. Oh, he's gonna get the vice squad on my ass. Oh my god, it's gonna be like those statutory rape charges. Have you ever been in prison on statutory rape charges, man? They come in at you with the showers! Yay! Oh, and she was 18. Oh my god, this <laughs> is gonna be worse! Listen, you babbling cocksucker, one god's name is wrong. It's Salvatore. He was kidnapped while leaving the club. Well, why didn't you it's say about time. Make me listen to He's that going crap. to that club too much. One of the guys that took Salvatore. He just happened to be right there oh, in the little car. <laughs> Holy! Okay, we're got some guys after us. I need this. So we just need to follow this guy, uh, and he'll lead us to Salvatore. He can't drive, that's one thing I learned about him. You're too close. Oh, we found the location! Where is he? In a trunk? Good. We're taking him to the crusher. The boss wants him flattered and oh. pizza. Also, how did we see that from where we are? Like, from here, you cannot see what was going down. How do we know Salvatore is truly in that car? No. Oh, look, they're stuck, the idiots. Got one of them. And the other one. <laughs> He got out, opened the door, shut the door with his head off. Amazing. So, just gotta get Salvatore out of here now. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. Is that you, Mr. Leone? It's me, Tony. Hey, don't worry about a thing. I'm getting you out of there. The door is just stuck open at the back. There we go, you're saved. What kind of driving was that? You're trying to kill me? Mr. Leone, <gasps> oh, I'm sorry. What can I tell you? What just happened? The cutscene skipped and I got run over. <laughs> Stupid police! Shit, Fuck, you. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck! You! Fuck you! <laughs> okay guys, so I got no clue what happened. I apologize for that, but the cutscene skipped on its own. Like, the cutscene wasn't supposed to end there. But I just got run over. Um, should I reload the game and do the mission again? Well, okay, what I'll do is... um. Should I reload the game and do the cutscene again? Or should I just take the cutscene from someone else's video? Uh... I'll reload the game. So, uh, guys, sorry about that, but uh, I'll see you shortly. Look at all these black cars. Whoa, okay. Someone's in a hurry. This music. I feel like we're in the Viking times or something. Listening to this. Imagine all the imagine the Vikings singing like this. Okay, I'm not 
gonna kill my backup again. Fancy music. Okay, so this is what happens when you don't kill your backup in an explosion. <laughs> I'll just show you how the cutscene looks. Hey, yes, sir. You were supposed to be here hours ago. Quit whining, Miguel. You got the stuff? Hey, I'm a busy man, Tony. Next time I'll find another buyer. Yeah, I doubt you find anybody else who pays what we do. <laughs> I like you, Tony. You got big balls, like a bull. You got our money? Sure. What? You greaseball fuck! Maybe the FBI has our money, oh! What was that noise? The police officer left his spikes out. I wonder what happens when people run them over. <laughs> are they all... Are they all running the spikes over? No. Okay, those... The tires on those cars didn't go flat, but uh... The tires on that police car certainly did. Okay guys, so this is what, what's gonna happen if you uh... The cops don't run you over and your backup doesn't blow up in an explosion. Funnily enough, I got the exact same car as last time, in the same color. Like, uh, if you remember, outside the garage at the end of the last mission, there was a red car. Uh, this time there was actually this blue one outside, so... Let's do this again. If there's a wanted level, I'm probably gonna try and lose it this time. Yeah, yeah, you go in there. Oh, look, it's Salvatore, yeah. You idiots are gonna go the wrong way, because I bumped you off. You idiots. Car is unattended. Perfect. So we didn't get a two star wanted level, so that stuff with the cops shouldn't happen again. The Mafia like their music, don't they? Is that you, Mr. Leone? It's me, Tony. I don't worry about a thing. I'm getting you out of there. I don't think Salvatore liked that. I don't think Salvatore liked getting bumped off the road. So this is what happens when you don't have a war of cops coming after you, a whole God, army of them. What was that? You trying to kill me? Mr. Leone, boss, I'm sorry. I mean, what can I tell you? Sons of bitches, they think they can do that to me? I'll tear their fucking hearts out. This doesn't end here. For Christ's sake, Tony, you saved my ass. Call me Sal. So that's what happened last time. Uh, well, that was what was supposed to happen. But uh, for some reason, the cutscene actually skipped itself when Tony got run over. That was all a complete accident right there. So we got another mission for JD now. Uh, we're finally hoping to push the Sundakos out of uh, Portland Island. I think the next mission will be our final move against the Sundakos, at least until later on in the game. If I'm not mistaken, I think the next one is where we make our final stand against them. But uh, that was a bit funny last time, I the cop just came in and run me down in the cutscene. I'm glad I got that on camera. I've had stuff like that happen before during other missions, but uh, I never recorded those ones. So this time we got the Guns of Leone. Thank God, Tony. JD, hey, I'm at the back of the... Uh... I know, I saw you go in. I've been praying you turn up. Salvatore's gone apeshit. He's coming down here personally to kill every Sundaco he can find. 
So I don't Probably hide. something to do with them Look, running me over. On the roof across the street. Oh yeah, sure no getting kidnapped. Salvatore. Wait, no! I got a nice sniper rifle, but I'm gonna have to replace it because I think the sniper rifle on the roof. I'm gonna take Hello! Out. Don't mind me. Uh, I think the sniper rifle on the roof is the shit sniper, and this one is the uh, the good sniper. Yeah, I'm gonna have to replace it. Funny enough, this is the same roof where you assassinate Salvatore in GTA 3, but uh, this time we're protecting him. <laughs> I fell off the roof. Oh, I'm back again. Dollar. Don't pick up money that's not yours. The police officer's just not caring. Salvatore's guards is dead. I knew that'd happen if they got in the way. Is that the best you got? Quick and easy mission. Now we're just gonna get into the back of uh, the club. Want a day to boot, boy? The hell was Salvatore doing in there? So as you see, the club is now under new ownership, so that's nice. Let's do the next mission. Calm before the storm. So, Salvatore clean house, huh? And now he's fixing up yours. It's all mine now, Tony! Those cock-sucking Sindacos all been kicked out. Listen, I hear the Sicilians are trying to broke a peace between the families. Sal's got some heavy up at his place right now. The thing is, he smells a rat. He wants someone to go up there and follow this guy, see where he goes. Okay, so, reach Salvatore's mansion. This uh, Massimo guy is leaving at 16.50 hours, so... So, uh, there's this Sicilian guy at Salvatore's place, and uh, something's not right about him, so we're gonna have to put a tail on him and see what he does. <laughs> yeah, this guy sort of does look like he's up to no good. <gasps> He's got blue trucker hat guy as his assistant! My arch enemy! Watch my, you know, previous videos if you want to know about blue trucker hat guy. But that guy has been a... had some funny appearances in the past. Oh look, there's blue trucker hat guy there as well! Is he in this van? Oh yeah, he is as well, look, he's in the passenger seat. So, uh, there's a, a history between me and this blue trucker hat guy, that's my little name for him. But he seems to be quite a rare pedestrian, because he doesn't really appear that much, he only seems to appear, like, in a car, like, he never appears, like, on foot as a pedestrian, which is a bit weird. But each game does have a few people who only appear, like, in traffic, and not on foot, if you know what I mean. So, uh, here's the Diablos. This guy is a rat. He seems to be dealing with these guys as well. Come siamo rimasti d'accordo. If you do my associates work for them, you'll be well rewarded. Hepburn Heights will belong to the Diablos. So that explains how the Diablos got their turf in GTA 3. There, now you can never tell your boys. <laughs> I'm going to take your car as well. Diablo Stallion. But Diablos are quite a rare gang in this game, they don't appear that much, so... Sometimes it does take a bit of trying to actually get a hold of this car. Where in GTA 3, this car is actually quite common around the city. 
This is kind of like stealthy music, isn't it? It's like sneaky spying music. Okay, so uh, Missillo, whatever his name is, is gonna land up here. So I'm gonna get my gun out. Blah, 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 what's going on? So here he's landing. Massimo looks to be landing up there. Oh, he's meeting the triads this time. So keep quei bastardi dei leone tied down. He's selling us out. Bastard. And when my associates control this city, you'll be taken care of. Ci pensiamo noi. Over there, it's the leone. How did he see me? He was facing the other way. Spying bastards. I'm over you, pal. Okay, we killed most of those guys. Let's go and take care of the last few of them. Okay, there's three guys. There's one. Can't, can't get a sight on that guy. And mission passed. So JD has another mission for us. I think this next mission is his last mission. And if so, will be the last mission of this video. Oh. So we're quite close to unlocking the second island of the game now. We're sort of entering sort of the final strand of the Portland missions after this next mission. So we're gonna do the Maid Man. Is JD gonna get made? Tony! It's all yep. happening today. I'm gonna be a Maid Man. Me! JD the Untouchable. <laughs> God help us all. I've waited a long time for this. It never would have happened without you, Tony. Hey, I'm crying over here. Come on. Hey, Mickey, how you doing? The ceremony's in Howard. Oh, that's Luigi's bodyguard from GTA 3. That's quite cool, he made an appearance. I can't get in the car, can I? <laughs> Don't mind me JD, I'm gonna get your suit all messed up. So we're gonna drive to this cemetery. Uh, I mean ceremony. I slaved for the Sendakos for years and nothing. Those bastards kept me down just cause a little I was blood in my veins. Wait, you can, you can only get made if you're full Italian. So how can he get made if he's got a bit of Irish blood in him? Also, we have some hitmen coming after us. I like the way I said cemetery. Well, I don't think it's any better where we are meeting. I think we're meeting him in the junkyard. Finish off some Daco Hitman. Where the hell are they going? I think they're stuck. I might just wait for them to get out of the car. <laughs> Yay! Tony, man, you gotta chill out. Finally, I don't need to be a made man. Don't talk to me. Hey, are what we the hell? How did that happen? Uh, where's Salvatore? Tony, the first drink's on me. <gasps> oh. Hey, the guy he was, was a killed. fucking rat. He screwed over his own boss. This scratchy eye. Salvatore could never have trusted that motherfucker. Dump the fucking oh. car on the river. You could drive me off on the way. To be honest, that is a good point. He did rat out the Sandakos for us. If the cops see the car like this, they'll pull us over for sure. So, you know, he could rat us out for someone else. So, yeah, it probably was a safe bet to kill him. So if the police see us, they're going to stop us, so we better avoid any police officers. 
Uh, now, fun fact, the cutscene when you drop Mickey off is different depending on whether you have the cops. Uh, if you have the cops after you, Mickey will be like, I'm getting the fuck out of here. But if not, he'll just be like, he'll walk and he'll be like, yeah, just dump the car in the river. So I'm sort of keeping my eye out for the cops. We don't really want to bump into them. So we didn't encounter any before hey, dropping them off. Remember, dump the car in the river. Okay. Now we're just going to get rid of this. Cops have spotted you with the car, okay. They'll have to catch me. Did it work? Also, did you see all these pedestrians just fall from the walkway? Better leave, because there's uh, some triads over there. So we should be getting oh, a little phone call now. Hey, it's me, Vincenzo. Uh, oh, what the hell do you The want? guy who likes to pick up your laundry having a bit of fun while calling his mom. Oh, come on. No, don't be like that. Listen, I feel bad about everything. Come on, drop by my place. I got something for you. Yeah, what's that? A pair of concrete boots? Nice slice. Don't know what happened to that phone call, but it went a bit funny. Did you hear that? It was like uh, a nice nice of arsenic, and then he just went all quiet. Well, anyway, guys, that phone call went a bit glitchy, but oh well. Uh, this is where I'm going to end the video, guys. I will see you again next time for more Liberty City stories. See you again next time. I wouldn't look at a drunk just if I was out. Look out, one of Ma's assassins is closing in. Uh, here we go again. Where is he? Is he in like a stupid van again? There he is! Well, bastard. These guys are starting to piss me off. These guys are shit.